Check out PG&E Park, Muskie. which is our version of, it's our Muskie. Say hello. With people in mind, so people can actually stand outside and watch the things out and you read what's on them. And um, yeah, pull it up, see what it says. Anything, you know, anything. Oh, wow. And it's just, it gives you, you know, it's, it's a think, interactive think piece. Welcome to Gary Paul TV. We're doing a tour of Pam Fifter's house in Portland, Oregon. That's Pam. Hey! <laughs> Great to see ya! Thanks! I mean, come on, let's go see what else we have. There you go. Who yeah. would live in a house like this? Exactly. <laughs> so, um, anyway, these are various auction. It's a word book. I like this. I like that too. I love this piece. I just have to figure out. But this used to be um, two bedrooms, and the previous owner has knocked down the wall. Um, and you can see out in the other hall, with where with the rug is lifted up, where there was a second bed, a second door coming in here. Um, wow, this is Pit Portland. This, this is, is Peach Pit Portland, and I welcome anyone to come and join me in my office. But here we have. My my Peach Pit sanctioned laptop. Look at I got my glasses right there. I'm ready to work it. So this is this is proof that Pam Pam really does work. I do. She really does have a place yeah. to work. Do you want me to sit down and type? <laughs> I do, and because I nearly. Do you have any comments as a while. former editor no, of Peach Pit? Not no. at all. No, I do have to say, <laughs> you know, the bloggers back in the back in the day when when women would actually fell the trees. I like the I can tell you a story about this. <laughs> These are Pam, Pam Originals, that's These are Ralph Pam Lauren. These are Ralph Lauren paint chips that I, I took from Home Depot. I very consciously decided which paint chips to take. I needed a harmonious look. This is, there is a place called Scrap, which is all about reusing utensils, or you know, things for um, art. These are all, of course, paint can lids that I bought for 10 cents a piece. And then a, a old cabinet door I bought from the um, Rebuilding Center on Mississippi for a dollar. And I liked the grid look of it. And better, they're all in Velcro. So should I decide to change my mind, I can do it. It's interactive. That's cool. <laughs> that's cool. Yeah, that's that's my big claim to fame. Like these two pieces. Forget about the good stuff. Um, this is an authentic Eric Gill um, print. And this is my mother on this bed Whoa, when she eight. was like 18 years old <laughs> she was she my mother my mother's my mother says like i have those two paintings do you want them too and i'm like i'm halfway going like maybe um, it's a little too creepy but my mom and my my mother's family was featured in a spread in the milwaukee journal about new ways of electricity, like how your home would be more, you know, well, well heated, I mean, all this stuff with the glories of electricity. So my mom was the teenage girl on, you know, look at the cross legs. I mean, the teenage girl doing her like, I'm reading my pop magazines. Um, but this was the bed. This is the actual bed that, um, that she was sitting on, lying on, I guess. That's a great So it's it's fun. That's a great that photo is it. of you with the key. Yeah. Go ahead, it's not fragile. It's not fragile. Oh, wow. Uh, 
can tell I'm really into mixed media. I try not to get too sappy about it, but and I think that when I see what it says inside. Oh really? Yeah. When I wow. when That's I cool. bought some of those pieces, it was like when I was going through my bathroom. Wow. And this is where Pam does her business. This is Pam. This is where Pam craps and washes her face. Wow. But please come in. Let's come see. in and see. Look at this. This is this is no regular shower. This is like I can tell you that's that a party in the shower. That the director Gus Van Zant has been in the shower. Wow. It's been referred to as the porno shower. But you have not lived until you've taken a shower in this really? shower. Oh wow. And when you get, if you ever like have a wheelchair or anything, you'll be able to just roll it right in there. I might need a mini ramp, but yeah, I could do it. So Look at this, honey. Just one and a half. So this one? This yeah. one and there's a half bath downstairs. And it's the, my constructivist the, bathroom. That's the one Full of the, Russian constructivist art. That's the yeah. one in the, off the kitchen? Yes, indeed. That's a half. So if somebody I'm, wants a lot of privacy, they got to come straight upstairs. Pretty much, but I'm hoping to build another <sighs> private area upstairs okay. in the attic, so which we have not yet been to. Dungeons are usually below. Not no, above. we're talking about lofty heights here. Okay. Okay. I have them, and that's where they are. The time. Time. You know, they were they were whimsical and dreamy, and they were where I was. Yeah, we Into the not. third story. Ooh. Not doing it yet. Are you sorry? Went to New Mexico this past weekend. Oh wow, perfect. Yeah. 